Hello YouTube and welcome to a new series and this is going to be Let's Build a Wild West Town. Um, I've been hinting at this in videos in the past, uh, um, I think how to plan a plot and um, how to canyon cliff video. Um, you know you've sort of seen bits of this terrain before but I've actually been building on it so I really like this the way that as you come around this corner it just opens up into sight. Um, and as you can see, I've already got well underway in starting, and that's because uh, I started recording the making of this. Um, I think I recorded four or five episodes. Um, halfway through the second and through all of the third episode, my microphone died without me knowing. <laughs> so there's no audio for them. Um, and for some reason, between switching from uh, my previous PC, PC and moved all the audio across, told Sony Vegas where to find all of the um, footage and it still decided that it doesn't know where the footage is and I don't really know how to get it back so I've decided I'll just sort of finish up this first building use this as a nice introduction to the series and then we'll get on the way so this is my Wild West saloon um, it took me a while to get used to it this is a new style that I've not built before um, so some ideas were quite um, quite hard to get together, get to grips with, like the sort of plainness of the general buildings. Although I have added quite a bit of detail in. Um, so yeah, this is the outside of the building. The reason that these two sides are plain is well, this one's mainly at the back, and this one there's going to be another building right next to it. So I didn't really want a lot going on. So let's start here, I guess. Uh, you come up here, there's a nice little wanted sign, and a nice sign uh, design using this. Uh, it does float a bit, but you don't really notice that much. So we've got Smokey Joe's Saloon. Um, Smokey Joe's is a name of a pub in Liverpool that's all Wild West and stuff, so just rob that. I think it's Smokey Joe's. Smokey Joe's or Smokey Moe's. So we've got this nice little deck all around here. We've got some plants around this side to give a bit of colour. We have our little saloon doors, and for some reason, there's an invisible bit of the top half of the door here. That just, I just can't get that to not be there without ruining that door. And then we come inside here, and I'm really, really happy with this interior. Um, I've got a mix of the 5 colon 12, which is this block here, uh, spruce slabs, which is the rougher edged one, and then we've got some brown carpet, and I'm not quite sure what biome this is in. There's quite a few variations, and uh, you get this nice texture, so that makes the floor really broke, nice and broken up. Um, we'll start going to the left here. We have a table that's messed up. So I can actually show you how I do these tables. Um, I go over here, copy the top half of the, bis the piston with your stick, shift and right click to paste it. And just paste it in front of those blocks, and there you go, we get a nice table. And we get to put things on top, so we've got the little drinks. Uh, we have a nice pool table. Now I didn't know about this texture. This is a um, Mega Tega biome and it's the green carpet. Uh, this is something that Manoa told me about. Um, so shout out to him for that. We also have some hidden lighting underneath here for our little pool table. Right at the back we have a piano design. Um, I think again I think Manoa uh, had done a plot review. Although I'm not sure if uh, his plot actually made it onto one of the videos that went out. He had a nice piano, uh, that's where I got the light sensor idea for it, but the rest I can hopefully say is mine. I'm sure there's probably people who've done a very similar thing and it'll look quite similar. I've got this really nice railing design going on on the roof, so we've got a nice ceiling design. It's not all boring because we've got quite high ceilings for this section. And the tables are all quite simple, really. Um, very basic, very simple, but that's again it goes with the style. We've got a large area here for dancing as well. Got a nice bar. Um, I think Denzak said I had this originally pushed into the wall. He said it should be pushed out. So there you go. Stuck that out, and it does look better, but it does make this a bit more cramped, and I wanted there a bit more space behind here. But it looks better, so there you go. We've got some nice little storage down here that you can't really get to unless sort of you move that chair out of the way and you go under the stairs and stuff. And then 
we have a nice kitchen back here. Uh, there's no basement or anything, I wasn't too sure what to do about that. And then through here, we have a little gambling den. Um, and you can't actually get through this door, and you can't actually see through the bottom of that door. Uh, just about. And again, this ceiling thing continues through in all the rooms. Um, so that's about it for the downstairs. I really love as well with the shaders how I'm stood here and you can see the glaring light coming from there and from there. You can just imagine sort of cleaning a glass and uh, somebody just silhouette at the door and it's like, oh, it's going to kick off. Just feels like one of those Wild West films. Just, yeah, I really like it. Upstairs, I'll be honest, this isn't really great up here. I got quite bored and I couldn't really think of anywhere for hidden lighting so we've just got a very simple ceiling design going on here and why not um, we've got these small candles lighting up everywhere here a great open window because I really need to start doing that more in my buildings having open windows and my plan is to have whatever building's going to be here you're going to be able to parkour onto it um, onto the roof of that building so that'll be quite fun the bedrooms got each have got closets chests bed and stuff and this one has a little balcony just again just to add a bit of variation to this wall because it looked quite bland on the outside and we have another one again just another variation writing desk and stuff this one is sort of like the main bedroom for the women got this extra elongated bed uh, three blocks long again to do that I just copied and pasted the bottom half of the bed texture and just pasted it on there that's quite a nice larger room and we have the smallest room it doesn't really have a writing desk but you know it's, it's quite nice in here doesn't have any curtains either and then we have all this sort of more private booth drinking areas and then the doors that lead out onto the upper part of this walkway. I've left this open because I'm not too sure what to do with it. I'm probably just going to do this and just block it off. Like that. I'm not too sure yet. This walkway goes all the way around. All the way around. All the way around. And comes down right at the back here. So it covers about two thirds of the building. I'm still not sure whether to make a little access panel to get actually up here onto the roof. Uh, I'll just leave it open like this and yeah we have a little chimney coming out there oh this is that back door with a little gambling den is and you can just about see the floor in there but you can't really see much else so I'm quite happy with the way that looks over here we're planning on having a train station uh, so the train tracks and everything there, the train's going to end, this will be the end of the line. Uh, over here is going to be a bank. Uh, we're going to have a school, we're going to have a, a chapel or church, lots of buildings. Uh, we're going to have a mine here, some like Native American caves over there, a little bandit camp over there. And if I just go over to this big blue sign over here, it'll actually tell me all the buildings that I'm planning on having. So gun shop, barbers, tailors, sheriff's office, school bank, pub, hotel, post office, you know, lots of things, it's going to be quite a large busy town, hopefully. Uh, I'm having fun building this, it's something new, uh, that I've never tried before, western stuff, so it's been a challenge, um, I am getting quite a lot of people's input from the server, so, you know, if you're on the server and you see me asking, come over, because I will listen to any and all ideas won't be taking any and all that like won't be taking all of those ideas on board but I will definitely be listening to them and taking your suggestions and stuff also if you've got any, any ideas for improving put down in the comments below and I always read the comments and comment back where necessary uh, but yeah I think that's all I need to talk about in this first video I know this isn't really a building episode of a let's build but with stuff that's gone on, this is sort of what we're left with. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and I'll see you guys in the next one.